This is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to animate Roblox on Blender. You need a couple requirements. You're gonna need Roblox Studio, you're gonna need Blender, you're gonna need the Blender plugin, and you're gonna need the R6IK rig for Blender. All of these items will be linked in my description. Okay, so once you've opened up Blender, you should see like a cube object, or if you don't see it, you'll probably see like a UI. You don't necessarily need to be in that, but you just go to File, you click Open, and you find the character of Link in the description, if you haven't already downloaded it. Go grab that, it should say r6ik.blend, and then you open it, and it should show up with this character here. Now what you're gonna need to do is you also need to go to edit preferences then go to add-ons and install and the thing I've also linked in the description thought pi should be right here rbx animation importer and you click install add-on now if you can't find it all you gotta do is search it. So just RBX. Right there. Roblox Animations Importer. Which for some reason I don't have enabled. Anyways, it's enabled now, and you should see this thing show up on the side. You should see all these options. Now we don't need to be using this right now because this is where you're supposed to be making your animation. So, let's make a simple waving animation. Okay, so this is kind of simple. It's not really that great, but... It's just an example animation, and um, what you're going to need to do is you go to RBX Animations, and you export animation. Now this is done, you'll have to go into Roblox Studio. Okay, so once you're in Roblox Studio, you're going to need to, um, going to need to get character inserter, if there isn't already one imported into um, Roblox Studio itself, I'm just using the Moon Animator one, but there should be one in there. If you can't find one, you should just go to um, Toolbox and search Character Inserter, and you should find one in Plugins, and I think there's a couple free ones that you can choose from. Anyways. Now, let's just put, I don't know, R6. Okay, so here's my R6. The next thing you're gonna need to get is you need Blender Animations. So what you do is you go back to Toolbox and you find Blender Animations, which is right here. And you uh, get it, and you install it, and then you should find it right here. Once you click Blender Animations, you click the rig model, and then um, this thing should show up on the side. If it doesn't, you should try again, and it should show up. And the next thing you're going to want to do is import your animation, and uh, paste what you um, copied from Blender. And there's my uh, little waving animation. Now what you gotta do next is you upload your animation to Roblox. And you should say like keyframe sequence or something. You can name it whatever, just name it waving. Description something or other. Like, hello, doesn't matter. It's an animation and you save. Once you've saved it, 
what you do is you go into your um, animator, which I'm using Moon Animator, if you guys are using that. And uh, you click your character, New Rig Animation. And uh, File, Import, Roblox, and select that animation that you saved to Roblox. Now, it might be glitched up for me a little bit, because um, it's already been playing, so let me fix that. Okay, so I just have to redo it now, so it just should be working here. Make sure you set the... Uh, Thing on loop if you're making like anything like walking or something if it's just an action or you're making like a movie or something you probably should put it on loop but if it's just a walking running waiting or some kind of other animation that you want loops just loop it and that's the waving animation 